Following the swift neutralization of terrorists at Dusut D2 complex by well-coordinated combination of various security forces, the political leadership has loaded the performance of security organs. We want to commend again our members of the security forces for the swift action that they took yesterday to deal with this attack. They showed real high standard of professionalism. We also want to commend very highly the work of our security of forces headed by our Inspector General and the DCIO and all other forces that have defeated the people who are holding our people here at uh, Duzi 2. It is incumbent upon Kenyans um, to, to guard our territorial integrity um, because these uh, criminals live among us. We thank our development partners who have continued to partner with our security agencies to en enhance their capacity and also exchange best practices which have resulted in improved response to the current tragedy. Even as the National Assembly Committee of Security and Administration congratulate the men and women in uniform for their speed response to terror attack, MPs are still concerned about the capacity of private security firms operating in the country. The MPs propose the government should come up with a policy to enhance the training of these private firms. Lazima tuakikishia kwamba wale mabawabu au wale maaskari wa kibinafsi ambao mara nyingi wao ndio wanajishughulisha na mambo ya kulinda hizi hoteli eh, katika kukagua yale magari ambayo yanaingia lazima yapate mafunzo ambayo ndiyo muhimu sana Leaders from the opposition wing while appreciating the efforts of security officers called for the revamping of Nyumba Kumi initiative sentiments echoed by the council of governors We are stronger when we are united we also thank the international community, our friends and partners, who at this trying time did not hesitate to sympathize with us. The terror attack has also revived the debate on withdrawal of the Kenya Defense Forces from Somalia, while the National Assembly Security Committee is calling for increased investment in pursuing of terrorists in Somalia. Ford Kenya Party leader Moses Wetangula wants the forces recalled to boost security within and along the country's borders. We shall continue supporting the president and national security agencies in the fight against crime, including the fight against terrorism by providing all the required resources and also formulating necessary legal frameworks to enhance security provision by both the government and private security providers. Ngine tunasema pengine muda wa kurudi nyumbani umefika ili tuweze kulinda nchi yetu kutoka ndani ya mipaka yetu kuliko kuendelea kupambana na majambasi nje ya mipaka yetu. Kevin Washira Channel News.